I left off. Greetings! And welcome to Let's Play Subnautica. Do you know that um, F11 is my stop the recording hotkey? Yeah, I didn't know either. <laughs> <laughs> so I prepared the time capsule. Put in for the long and lonely nights. Silicon rubber and lubricant. Time capsule ready. And let's end it again. I was quite shocked because I saw that the video was not recording and I was like, oh fuck, I hope I didn't. Uh, but I was checking and so on and so forth and then I was like, oh, okay. And then I checked the video. There was a video there and then I checked it. I was like, oh, okay. Let's do the ending real quick again and yeah. Ready to launch on your command, Captain. Launch in 10, 9, 8, Good. 7, 6, 5, 4, 2, 1. Bam. Time capsule jettison. I wonder if there are no two time, time capsules of me out there. Caution. Approaching orbital debris field. Uh-oh. Yeah. No, no, not again. No. Oh, oh. Oof. Oof. Okay. Orbital debris field clear. Performing gravity turn maneuver. Confirm destination coordinates. Nearest interstellar phase gate. Engaging ion boosters in three, two, one. There. What is a wave without the ocean? A beginning without an end. They are different, but they go together. Now you go among the stars, and I fall among the sand. We are different, but we go together. Done! The music is getting a bit louder now, <clears throat> but like I said, a really enjoyable game. If you enjoyed, if you enjoyed this game, buy it. If you enjoyed watching me play it, let the developers know <laughs> that you bought it because of me. <laughs> and yeah, I'm quite happy. I'm enjoying the music. <laughs> Special thanks to Bill Wang. <laughs> yeah, I always take my Wang too. 8 bit wild. Okay. YouTube and Twitch streamers everywhere. Ah, oh, they mentioned me. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Permission to land will be granted once you have settled 
your outstanding balance of one trillion credits. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> I'll get why right do it. Like I said, a really enjoyable game. I like that you didn't need to. Oh yeah, you need fifty thousand titanium in order to build one corridor. I liked it that you you always knew what to get next, so the game was kind of hinting it at you. Um, it gave you lots of reasons to explore, like you need you knew you need you needed the prawn suit and stuff like that. I liked it that it gave you also these directions with these um, survival pots on where you can go, where you should go, and check out stuff like that without. Um, like 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 gate like um like being a corridor like you know like showing you like you didn't feel like okay i have to do go here 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 and here then i'm done you could still explore and it was really beneficial to explore but you also knew okay there are like three areas that, which i should check out because there may be interesting stuff over there um the combat in this game yeah it wasn't focused on combat so i really can't complain about that I kind of liked it that they made it quite easy in that regard because you didn't need like, oh yeah, you need 50 titanium in order to repair uh, one hole in your submarine. Um, I don't know how they could have done it, you know, with with using resources, maybe one titanium per hole, but pff, that's super vicious. Um, all in all, a really enjoyable game. I really liked playing it. Considering my safe game is still there, I can <laughs> go back and build a bigger base or something like that in my free time. Anyways, like I said, I have no other game planned for you now. Maybe I will take another break. Maybe I will find something in the meantime until this is uploaded. We will see, but I will let you know in a vlog. Okay, I thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and we will see each other soon. So take care and... Goodbye.